What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Landers. You already know. You see it. You see it. LNL Line Service, Kansas City, Missouri, Blue Springs area. Mm -hmm. Back at you. Hey, guys, I just pulled over. I just wanted to make a quick video uh, about the situation with customers sometimes asking you to do extra stuff and they want you to kind of they ask you in a subtle way where it's like you know I give you a perfect example I had just got finished cleaning or um, doing a yard customer of mine and a great customer pays on time you know don't don't try to do you down on the prices or nothing like that great customer Anyway, it's hot outside. Today's supposed to be 97 and up. The last couple of days, all the way till Thursday. But uh, it's going to be in the 90s, 95, 97, 98, 99, things like that. I think it's supposed to be 99 today. But anyway, like I said, it's hot out here. So this is the time during a season where you earn your your money because you got you know your yards it doesn't need as much trimming or you can come back the next following week and trim you know make sure you just trim the hot spots hot spots mean whatever the customer can see when they walking up to their house and things like that you know but sometimes uh, you can get away without trimming because it's not really growing um, and you can trim the next following week, especially if you're on a weekly schedule. So I cut the grass, I trimmed it, I did everything, and then when I uh, went to go get the check, she gives me the check and she says, uh, hey, I was wondering if you could do me a favor and uh, knock down that flower bed on the side. Now this flower bed has been growing with weeds and it has plants and, you know, her her plants and she said well it's they're 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 not going to be blooming anymore so just just knock all that down now she's saying it casually like it's nothing like after you're done doing what i pay you to do then i want you to do something extra and she's and and she said it like can you when she's giving me the check it's like can you do me a favor can you also uh knock down that flower bed on the side you know, just knock all of it down. Now I'm looking at the flower bed, and it takes a. It's going to take about. I mean, you can weed whack it and stuff like that, but it might be a, you know, a thicker branch in there where you got to go get the lopper and all that stuff. And I'm thinking to myself, she basically wants you to clear this bed out or just knock it down. You know, and I'm just thinking to myself, oh, it's going to be like another ten minutes messing around with this thing and it's hot outside it's like peak 90 97 degrees so when she gave it to me like i said she said can you do me a favor can you knock that flower bed down and stuff like like it's nothing so i was like well ma'am i uh i could do that but i'm gonna have to charge you extra and then she says oh never mind then never mind so that's just go to show, you know, uh, how customers um, will try to ask you to do extra stuff, not knowing that you charge for that. And if you charge for that, you got to let them know. Now, back in the day, uh, when I first started, I would have probably knocked it out. I probably would have went and went, <sighs> all right. And I probably would have went and did it without charging them and stayed another 10 minutes doing that and knocking it down. Now, you can, it's just not worth it because once you do that, then it'll be something else. Well, I was wondering if you could trim that. Can you do me a favor uh, before you go? This is what they be doing. Before you go, can you just... Uh, uh, cut those 
all those branches down right there. Just cut that one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Those nine branches down. Uh, can you cut those down before you go? Can you do me a favor? And you're thinking like, that's a separate charge. That's extra work. That's another little work order, you know what I mean? So uh, don't fall for it. You know, I know in the beginning stages, you know, you don't want to, you don't want to uh, lose customers or you think you'll lose a customer or, or, you know, you're not used to talking to the customers and things like that. But after you get seasoned, you'll look back at some of the things that you, all the work that you used to do for free or a favor and you'll be like, man, I supposed to have been charging for that. And you never did. You left money on the table. We've all done it. So uh, if customers ask you to do anything else, flower beds. I also had a customer uh, and I dropped him quick. Uh, he asked me to... Um, uh, he asked me to weed eat his flower beds and they had rocks in there and mulch and all that stuff in it. And I told him that's a separate charge. You got to have to have this sprayed or the weeds pulled or whatever, but it's all a separate charge. And they, some customers think that this is the weed eating the flower beds and things like that is part of uh, the service as far as the the maintenance you know uh but it's not you know they can add that in there and you can do that and but you have to charge for it if you want to spray uh the flower beds or weed eat the flower beds you know oh yeah i can weed eat the flower beds but i'm gonna charge you when i do it extra if you want me to do that then i'll be more happy to do it uh but just know that you're going to be charged extra and i just let my customers know that so uh you just got to get used to talking to the customers build the confidence up to to stay your ground and and to know your worth and and and, and what you charge for don't all the little extra stuff i don't care if it's 10 15 the the thing about it is she didn't even ask me how much i would charge her to do that now since she's my customer you know, uh, doing weekly lawn maintenance, weekly cuts, you know, I probably would have just said, all right, uh, I can knock that down for fifteen, twenty dollars extra. You know what I mean? Or I could have said I could knock it down for twenty, twenty five extra. You know, so she didn't even ask that. She just wanted it free. She just wanted me to put that in there. Now she knew that I probably was going to tell her that I can't do that because just the way the tone and the way she asked but they tr she tried to do it slick you know like can you do me a favor ain't no favors over here I'm gonna have to charge you for that oh never mind never mind then alright well you have a nice day and that's what you gotta do alright guys that's my time I just wanted to share that with you like, subscribe, leave your comments, hit that bell button. Do whatever you got to do, but you better do it. All right, guys, I'm out. Peace.